Hi right, guys, Paramad22 back here again with another video of the Witcher 3 walkthrough. So, we were just with the Peller, so as you can see there, we have to try and find his goat. Or else he won't be able to do it in Norgri, so... We have to ring the bell. And then he'll come running when, once he hears the bell. And then you have to lead him back. Okay, who's coming? Okay, we heard him. Somebody there. Who's I that? Like that silver. Wild dogs, are they? Wolves. Okay. Yeah, I took them out. Oh, there he is. This way, I think. Another clue. Okay. There you are. Come on, let's go see the Peller. Come on, damn it. Should have guessed as much. What's a Witcher compared to a patch of wild strawberries? Do I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow? This way, your grace. <laughs> you have to ring the bell. The poor goat won't follow you otherwise. Where the hell did you go? Bear. Who's coming? Bear! Run, you stupid piece of shit! And the bear's down. Didn't want to do that, but he probably wouldn't leave me alone. So, we'll go. Do I really have to keep ringing this bell for me to follow? Nearly there now. Back to the hut. You're no roach, but I bet we can be friends in time. You've got that all-important quality every roach has to have. You don't talk much. Nowhere in sight. Nowhere to be found. Princess. Done. Goat of mine, dearest, sweetest goat. He's got his little princess back. Happy for you, but I'm kind of in a hurry. Anna and Tamara, they might be in danger. The white wolf helped the Pella, and so the Pella shall help him. Blood. We need blood. A living being.
fine. Be right back. Yeah, what else we have to do? Will this do? over is that it that is it spirits had nothing more to say like where they went or where they are now you came for an augury an augur I did they're gone the child remains mentioned a child whose why Anna's Anna was pregnant she was and she miscarried hmm. Baron didn't mention it afraid perhaps or ashamed, or forgetful. Or perhaps he had no wish to remember. Anna tell you all this? Did she come here after it happened? Nay, not Anna. It was the omens told me. Great, so I can be sure it's true. The omens need not your faith to be true. It is you who needs the omens to lead you to truth. Did the Baron have anything to do with his wife's miscarriage? Foul-tempered he is, and he's a fondness for Hooch. No doubt makes his temper even fouler. Did he abuse his family? Anna came to you, you must have noticed something. The Pella's old, near blind. But Princess came and licked her hand. So what? She's a wise beast. Only comes to those who suffer. What happened to the child? In a grave throne. Without rite or ceremony, it awoke. Now it wanders, it seeks vengeance. A botchling. White wolf, wise wolf, catch the botchling. The botchling will help, lead the wolf to the loved ones. Botchlings suck the blood of pregnant women and eat their fetuses. They don't help. Tis a being cursed, and witches lift curses. If the white wolf can't lift it, he should bring me its blood. Blood will always find kindred blood. I've heard of one witcher who lifted a botchling's curse. Never tried it myself, though. I know you need to bury it under the threshold. And give it a name. Perform the I'm Roin. The ritual of naming? That's an elven custom. Human, elven, dwarven, ancient. Spirits have no race. They honor not its meaning. Win a spirit's favor, and the spirit shall aid you. Ask, and it will answer. Seek, and it will show you the way. Why do you want its blood? Blood, blood, blood. It binds men for all ages, the living and the dead. Sure, but what do you want to do with it? At times, a century is too short for two brothers to reconcile. One dies before things are set right. The other then brings his... Mm -hmm. And what does the Peller do? He awaits forefathers' eve. There shall be no forefathers' eve this year. I hear you right. You mentioned Forefather's Eve. Pretty old custom. Thought it had died out. Death lurks in every bog and puddle round here. Then they require help, or they'll not know peace. Forefathers light the tallow candles to lead them through the dark. Call them by name. Appease their regrets. Only then. Whatever I do, I gotta find the botchling first. Seek it at midnight, near the grave that lies empty. 
If what you say is true, the Baron ought to know where that grave is. Hmm. Yeah, so we've just finished now with the Peller. He gave us two little side quests going on. So I'll talk to the Baron and read, read the beast rate, learn more about Oxford. So we'll have a look at the glossary. B3. Okay, the bear. Cursed ones. Botchlings. Botchling. The thing of botchlings is like saying, you see, it's not particularly tasty. You can't say it's lie, but it doesn't actually convey the whole truth. Okay. Let's that bit done, and then talk to the baron. So now I really have to get both of my swords fixed. So let's have a look here. Can we fast travel? I can go to the blacksmith here in Buckthorn, so let's have a look here. See if I can get anything fixed. So here we are in Buckthorn. Can I get any of my equipment fixed? It would be nice. Blacksmith. Yeah? Craft special order weapons too? Do politicians murder high class prostitutes? Of course. <laughs> I'll take a look. Maybe pick something. Okay, so he's got a few weapons. Mostly all out of my reach though. At the moment. I'm gonna take weapon kit by those three. And that for the time being. So long. Let's have a look here now. So inventory. Buttons. So I need to fix my Witcher sword. And my Silver sword. Is that fifty seven per cent? Is that seventy two per cent now? Okay. Great. Needed that. No, we'll leave it at that, and then we will go back in to the next walkthrough when we go back to the Bloody Baron. So as ever, guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you again with a new video. Thank you. See you soon.